What's happening to Wilcon? The stock moved up. What are you supposed to do if you're an investor, a quick trader, and a position trader? How can you win? How can you use technicals and fundamentals to help you make money in the stock market? Check this video out. Hey guys, so this is Marvin Germo from Avenue of the Giants in California. I'm still trying to make my way from California all the way up to Seattle. So more updates, more videos as I go about my way. So with that, I'd like to update you on Wilcon. Uh, Wilcon just broke out again uh, from another short-term resistance because you have to remember this, the stock plotting its overall trend it's still in an uptrend that's why if you are a position trader following the uptrend itself uh, this, there was no sell signal yet following the uptrend and if you are a position trader your goal even though it's still up remember the IPO was at 5 pesos you're now up uh, more than three times already and here's what's interesting also no people would say that since it's a consumption stock it's not gonna be as good that's why we don't have to rely on what other people tell us our goal our narrative our style on how we win is we decide based on what the fundamentals are telling us or what the technicals are telling us as well just a preview for those who don't know what Wilcon is Wilcon basically is a supplier uh, they're could they're basically also part of the consumption driven economy that we have think about it whatever you see um, all of the condos being built in Metro Manila, they are part of it. Whatever you see uh, that gets built, no, all of the kitchen, uh, all of the kitchen designs, all of the all of the things that you see in the bathroom, uh, all of the all of the fixtures that you would see, they're all directly related also to Wilcon, being that they're also expanded and they're part of a larger part of what's happening in Metro Manila. Yes, what what? That's a tree branch. That's a what? That's a branch. Okay. Of the tree. So this is a very, 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 very big tree branch. Yvonne, what, what can you say about Wilcon? Naman? Nothing. Nothing? You just wanted to update me on the tree branch? Okay, so guys, large tree branch. My wife's walking there while she's walking. Let's talk about Wilcon again. So, as you all know, for whatever condo that gets built, Wilcon will just make money off of it. Because a lot of people will get their sinks, will get their tiles, will get their fixtures. So it's directly proportional to a lot of people who are getting new houses and new condos in the Philippines. So I really believe this. If you're banking on that the property development scene will be well, and you're banking on that a lot of Filipinos are going to still earn money over the next few months, and a lot of people will. Alam mo yun, when you see, and when, when friends see nice condos, they want to copy their friends, also want to get their own house or condo as well. So it's still part of the of Filipinos culture that they still want to decorate their house as well. So you can expect that the growth of Pure Gold is also under the guise, under the notion that there is still a lot of Filipinos who are being more affluent already. More affluent Filipinos means more renovations, more fixtures, more changes, more income for Wilcon well so that's one so that's what I, i'm still expecting growth over the stock over the next few years but aside from growth for the stock over the next few years i'm also expecting that because it's already good it's shown you great growth over the past years you can expect that it will still continue so back to the technicals for position traders it's still in an uptrend it's still in a longer upward movement uh, and i've said this in the previous videos where we talked about wilcon no need to sell. You are a position trader. You are following the trend. The goal of position traders is to follow the trend. If the trend is still up, hold. No need to sell. Even if you're up more than 200, 300 plus percent, stay in your position and hold. That's where what that's where discipline will make you a lot of money in the market. That the urge to sell will be there, but as long as you're disciplined to hold, will still tell you to stay as long as it's still moving up. No need to sell. Now, if you're a quick trader. The stock broke out again with a very 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 strong force the goal of quick traders is to hold the stock until the next resistance will appear since the stock is now pushing toward higher movements 
you can't really expect the stock to go lower yet. So I'll update you over the next few days or weeks until a new resistance will possibly emerge or you see a short-term consolidation which could be a quick take profit area for quick traders as well. So if you notice it, there are different styles for both position and quick traders on how you could uh, follow the stock. For those who bought it during the breakout uh, just a day ago, congratulations to all of you. I hope that you guys are making it and that's why technicals is nice eh? because everything you need to know is found in the charts. And you know what's interesting? Uh, what what could be the news item that the could have caused Wilcon to go up? I don't know. But the, the fact that even if I'm in California right now, I still get to analyze my stocks because I do not need to follow or chase the news because everything I need to know is found in the charts. So that's Wilcon from an investing perspective. Good growing company, part of the macroeconomics of the Philippines, but also part of it, you can also analyze it using technicals via position trading and quick trading as well. So I guess that's it. Uh, just comment below if you have any more questions that you would want us to tackle as well or you would want us to discuss while I'm here. I'll make as much videos as I can as promised. But Yvonne, on lain nandi na lahat natin. Di ba tayo mawala dito? Di pag nawala. Camp na lang. Camp na lang. Wala naman tayong tent eh. Kaya mo yan. Wala kaya ko to. Boy Scout ka di ba? Boy Scout. BSP of the Philippines. Pero wala natin sa Philippines eh. So walang silbay pagka Boy Scout dito. The same. Paano? Wala nga tayong dalang ano eh. Wala tayong dalang Swiss knife. Army knife. Kaya nga nga Boy Scout ka ba? O kaya nga Boy Scout may Swiss Army knife. Tsaka may ano may... May carabao na nakalagay dito ng necktie. <laughs> may carabao necktie yun. No, we need that eh. What carabao necktie? Meron yun. Necktie? Alam namin yun. May mga boy scout na ganun. Oh, oh boy scout eh. Dapat nag-iwan tayo ng ano, breadcrumbs eh. Para hindi tayo maiwan. Yeah, yan. Yeah, oh. Ang daming trail eh. Oh, ang daming trail. Dito guys, sabi, niya, sabi ng wife mo dito daw, shinutin yung Lord of the Rings yung sa River Run. I'm not sure if she's telling the truth but I don't know. I don't know. Is Ito ba yun? Yes or no? What? Yes, no? River Run? Sa Game of Thrones. Yes, no. Okay. Okay, so that's it for now. Uh, I hope this video helps you trade well. Trade strong and trade smart. From the what place is this? From the Avenue of the Giants. From the Avenue of the Giants. See you all again soon for the next set of videos that we'll have. Look, but look at it, guys. So so obran laki ng trees. So whoa, the trees are so big, so big, so big, so big. So that's it guys, bye bye. Boom.